Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. I hope you are all doing well. In this video, I will show you how you can jailbreak iOS 16.7.10 on all of your devices, including your iPhone 8, 8 Plus, iPhone 10, or any other device which is running this version. After a successful jailbreak, we will also install Cydia and Troll Store since this will be a root full jailbreak and we will be using WinRain on Windows so you do not need a USB flash drive to jailbreak your device. The same process can be used to jailbreak. I use 15.8.3. You can also use the Neko jailbreak to jailbreak this version and install Cydia and Troll Store on it. The guide for the Neko jailbreak is in the description. The method shown in this video along with the Wintrain, Cydia and Troll Store is completely free. Before you begin jailbreaking iOS 16.7.10, please backup your device using iTunes, all right? Please create a backup. And if you have a passcode set or face ID, you will have to disable it so simply go to settings scroll down to touch id and passcode and please disable it after you disable it go to general scroll all the way down to transfer or reset iphone and then erase all content and settings if you don't the device will panic when you jailbreak it and after that please do not set a passcode or your device will panic and then restore the backup so you do not lose any data and then you can proceed with the jailbreak. So you will find this WinRain 2.0 package in the description or in the pinned comment as a link. Again, it is completely free. So first of all, from this package, simply unzip it or uncompress it and then install USB DK first. If it asks, please restart your PC. Also to make WinRain work, you must install iTunes. You can install iTunes from the official Apple's website and if you already installed it from the Microsoft Store please uninstall it and get it from the Apple's official website to your Windows PC from here. Now simply right click WinRain 2.0 and then run it as administrator. Now when WinRain opens up it will now display your device and its version so for me it is 16.7.10 and on your device, you will see a dialog to trust your device with this computer. So hit trust. We will be doing the rootful jailbreak. So we will select rootful. If you prefer rootless, you can simply select rootless and follow the guide. Now after selecting rootful, first of all, select create fake FS. So this is step one. Make sure USB DK is checked. And if your device is not displaying up here, you can Hit fix driver to fix any issues. Now hit next. You will see this dialog which shows that you must disable passcode and then reset your device as I have told you in the beginning. Hit OK and your device will go into recovery mode. From there, we will get it into DFU. Hit start and simply hold the buttons as it is being shown on WinRain. Now please leave it here. The fake FS can take about 10 minutes. So please leave your device here. And after the process is complete, your device will reboot to normal mode. All right, as you can see, the fake FS is now done and my device is now booted up into normal mode. And to check, we can see that we lost about 10 GB of space on this device. So the fake FS is done. Now on WinRain, hit done and then remove the check to create fake fs this time and then keep rootful then hit next hit ok again your device will go into recovery mode now again simply follow the instructions start and this will again get your device into dfu mode all right so now we will wait for this phase to complete if you see itunes flashing please do not worry now this process can take a few seconds. In checking phase, the device will boot up and then the process will complete. When you go in, you will see this pale rain loader on your home screen. Now we can close out of wind rain. Now on your device, 
simply make sure you are connected to the internet and then open the parent loader now from there install Cilio install all right you will see installing after that you will see this prompt please set a passcode you can use any passcode of your choice and then hit set all right install completed close and you will see Cilio on your home screen let's open it and check out the version first you can see 16.7.10 and it is an iPhone 8 plus if you have any packages you can simply upgrade them done go to sources and add a source hit this plus button above allocate dot space add source this is must to run your tweaks go to allocate all categories and then install allocate get cute and confirm all right so after allocate is installed go in open Celio, go to search and secondly install the preference loader you can simply search for it and install preference loader done and now your device is properly configured to install and run your tweaks now to install Cydia open Safari and head to the link in the description to get this cdia.dev file again it is also completely free you can simply get it to your device download go to downloads open it and then hit this share button then share it to Cilio. you will get this cdia installer hit on get queued and then confirm all right now hit done now go back and you will see cdia on your home screen open it you can see it is working fine we will see the version 16.7.10 we have some upgrades go to changes upgrade confirm return to Cydia if the return to Cydia button is not working you will have to simply hit on close above and you are good to go now to make sure it works simply reopen it and no errors no issues all right now to show you that yes you can use Cydia to install tweaks we will be installing troll store from here you can also do so using Cilio. so i will go to search then search for troll store light you can use troll store helper as well but this is the new method to install troll store i will go with troll store light because it is pretty much the same thing install confirm return to cydia and then hit this close button above now go back and you will see troll store light on home screen you can open it and then install your apps using this plus button select an IPA file and install it please note the troll store on this version will only work while you are jailbroken in the end I will also test to install a tweak so I will go with Ampere modify install confirm and then restart springboard close and if the restart springboard button is not working on Cydia what you can do is press and hold on the pilgrim loader and then hit respring to respring your device all right once you go in open settings for all the way down and you'll see your tweaks right here so you can see they're being shown perfectly fine open it and let's enable it to see if it works after the respring you can see my battery icon has changed so this tweak is working fine without any issues towards the end if you want to remove the shell break and return back to stock you can simply open winrin if you see this dialog hit trust and then in root full then hit force revert all right then hit next hit ok your device will go into recovery mode again start and simply follow the instructions on screen if you see itunes flashing in the background please ignore it checking your device will now boot and then it will go into normal mode all right as you can see it right here my device is back to stock cdia cilio and troll store light are now removed we are left with the bellring loader you can simply hit close if you see this dialog now simply restart the device all right all right after restarting the device you can see the parent loader is now gone and now the device is completely back to stock also if you check out 
the 10 GBs we lost with the rootful jailbreak are also back. That's all for this video guys. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care.